Anna Good, and this is my homemade instrument. Um, I tried to replicate a tambourine, so I got a wire hanger, and I shaped it into a circle, and then I put on, like, bottle caplets, and I put... And then I put it back together and I put blue duct tape so as a handle and when you sh and this is how it sounds like. So that's my big tambourine and then I also made a smaller tambourine because I wanted to see what the sound difference would be because this is smaller and it has less space for these things to move but this is bigger and it has a lot of space for it to move. So it sounds different. So this, the smaller one sounds like this. And the bigger one sounds like this. So the bigger one sounds is bigger. And yeah, I hope you enjoy. And these are my homemade instruments. Bye. This is a system. It was originally created in ancient Egypt. And I made it for Boy Scouts. For my extra credit project, I decided to make a rattle. I made this rattle out of hickory nuts, yarn, and a stick. I was inspired to make this because my mom owns a bunch of shamanic rattles, and I think it represents culture very well, especially since this is the base of where all music came from. I'm very proud of the results, and I hope you like it. Hi, my name is Reagan Rockwell, and I'm in first grade. This is my instrument, and I put them like this and throw twice in it and this thing that covers over it so it doesn't spill and rubber bands and the spoon that you bump it into and now I'm going to bump this under and you can also shake it and you can flip it over on the other side of this. Bye! For my instrument I made a rain stick. It, it, is made out of a paper towel roll that I painted over. Inside it has rice with aluminum foil uh, to slow the rice down. On the ends it has tissue paper and wax paper to hold the rice in. And this is what it sounds like. All you have to do is take the string and just pull it and it creates the clicking noise. I am Jonah Claremont. This is my instrument. It's called a Super Kazuba. It has my name on it. It's made out of a cardboard tube and tissue paper, a rubber band, some duct tape to hold a tuba mouthpiece. And this is me demonstrating it. Hi, my name is Eliza, and this is a uh, and and it's made out of um a ribbon and and another um ribbon with. And a fruit and another ribbon right here and a mouthpiece and there's me to demonstrate it. <coughs> okay, three, two, one, go. <coughs> Bye. 
What I picked for my homemade instrument is a tin can drum. All you need for a tin can drum is a tin can, two spoons, and your favorite design. How to play the tin can drum is you flip the can over when you see this metal part at the bottom, and then you take your two spoons and you can tap your favorite rhythm on the drum. There you go, that's how you play a tin can drum. Hello everybody and welcome to my show. I made a wakas out of macaroni and rice on the bottom. And I made ribbons and beads and I'm gonna play them for you. Mm-hmm. <laughs>